The Boss Castle Flood of 2004 um, was uh, a very bad, unprecedented flood for the area. I was going to draw a very bad, probably, map of the southwest of England. And this would be Wales, the Midlands, London over here. Um, Boss Castle is somewhere along this coastline, so in Cornwall. And the physical causes of this flood were the valley sides in Boss Castle were very steep very steep valley so the water flows off the sides of the valley very very quickly um, it's quite a small catchment area and so the water that falls in this area gets to the gets to Boss Castle really quickly and it'd been an exceptionally wet summer so it rained an awful lot and all this combined to mean that this little bottleneck at the bottom here um, flooded quite badly and the village of Boss Castle was was there and there were some human causes as well there'd been a lot of building in Boss Castle, which had created a lot of impermeable surfaces, and a lot of their bridges were very, very small. Which meant that as the rivers did fill up, anything that the rivers were carrying in the flood water got trapped underneath the, the bridges and blocked the bridges. And as the bridges were blocked, then the water further overflowed over the land. And there were quite a lot of effects of this flood, social, economic and environmental. Um, social effects are going to be things like injuries. There weren't any deaths, but there were there were some injuries. Um, and obviously it caused people a lot of stress as well because there was damage to their homes. Economic effects, mainly around the, the number of properties that were destroyed. 20 business properties that were destroyed. And this happened in August as well, the height of summer. And Boss Castle really relies on tourism, so that was quite bad for the economy locally. And environmental effects, well there were a lot of trees that were washed away and a lot of habitats that were destroyed. So all in all it was pretty catastrophic for the area. Question 1. What were the physical causes of the Boss Castle flood? The physical causes were that Boss Castle is a small catchment, um, it's got very steep valley sides and there'd been an exceptionally wet summer. Two, what were the human causes of the Boss Castle flood? There'd been a lot of building on the floodplain uh, which created a lot of impermeable surfaces and a lot of the bridges that crossed the river were quite narrow underneath which meant that they got blocked easily. Number three, name one economic effect of the Boss Castle flood. Well, 20 business properties were destroyed um, and this was the height of the tourism season in August. Um, and so this had a massive effect on the local economy.